Do y'all think Kareem is in the GOAT conversation? Because it's been a two-man race for me for a minute. I yeah, know. it's a two-man race for me. Is it because y'all didn't see Kareem? Is that it? I mean, I admittingly. Mean, you didn't see yeah, Kareem either, didn't, but didn't what, what would be the argument for him? I know we didn't see I didn't see him either. I'm just asking. Yeah, I, I'm just saying I haven't, y'all haven't seen Kareem. I get it, but I'm saying I have him in there, but for different reasons. So I'm asking, I, I'm really asking, why don't you have him in there? I think he benefited oh, from a very. Oh my God, bro. Like, my like, bad. From, my from bad. what I, you know, these niggas, from what I have seen, um, I've tried to go back and do some research on him. Obviously, seen a couple of games and eh, quality. I'm um, not gonna lie, I do think he's one hell of a talent, unstoppable move. But I think he benefited greatly from an era, and then I. This is gonna sound weird, but I think he could have somehow, like you know, done more for that era because I think the era is really bad. I think a lot of us think that era is really bad. And when you have a guy like Michael Jordan that did what he did in the area he did it in, you have a guy like LeBron James that did it. I think you can also argue they're better talents, let alone. So I think he's just he's snub, but you could very easily gaslight it or just be correct in the sense of I didn't I wasn't around for the seventies. Couldn't you say everything besides not being around? Well, you could damn near say everything that you said about Michael Jordan, right? You weren't around. He could have did more in that era. The era was weaker. I don't know. I don't know how much more he could have necessarily did. I'll say that outside not of quit. Not quit. Yeah, I'm about to say outside outside of not quit, but that doesn't that doesn't equate to um that that equates to necessarily his uh longevity. That wouldn't really affect his prime to me because at that point it's like, all right, when he's there, he does win. Even the time he came back. Uh, a lot of people get on him for that Magic series, but he averaged fucking 35 in that series. He just, you know, just came back, and I think um, some happened. I can't remember right now. I'm a little iffy on that. Y'all know I'm pretty iffy on that uh, era of basketball, but something happened in that series as well, or they just straight up lost. Uh, one of the two, I'm pretty sure something happened. I can't remember it. But regardless, uh, yeah, he three-peated twice in the era in his prime. My argument against Michael Jordan has always been longevity. It hasn't been, uh, you know, peak. Be so. Bro, these niggas, these niggas in Detroit are so ass, Rank. bro. Oh my, <laughs> bro, Chris Dunn is bussing these niggas at Chris Dunn, bro. Hey, next Chris Paul, man, he's a late boomer. Oh Be so, right, so, yeah, I'm, a, I'm gonna elaborate my point. So I'll say this: for Michael Jordan, I feel like the the most concise argument for a lot of people is the fact that he had the closest thing to the most perfect career you can have as an NBA player. Dominant out the gate, high peaks, MVPs, never lost in the finals. Um, had, you know, maintained that that GOAT level peak for a long period of time as well. The closest thing to it, and in terms of like his skills in the game as well. Not a lot of weaknesses in this game outside of three-point shooting. So that's the argument for MJ. LeBron would be maintaining a GOAT level peak for the longest amount of time. So we're talking about top three peak of all time. Um, top three production of all time and maintained that for 20 fucking years. So the reason why for me, Kareem, I have a question about him is like, what, what is that for him? What is the concise argument for Kareem? Cause I just, I just have trouble finding it. Especially when LeBron passes, um, some of the records like points, obviously, but... what you feel like, because he didn't have, and mind you, these are recent things. And if that's, if that's how you look at it, he knocked him out of the GOAT conversation because LeBron passed him in points and then longevity, like his longevity was longer longevity than Kareem. Is that, is that what you're saying? <laughs> longer longevity is crazy. <laughs> oh. Um, But, but yeah, that's, that is a pretty damning thing though. Even if you had to, I'm not necessarily saying that's the hill I'm dying on. Cause again, I think LeBron and Jordan were just better players in their prime as well. But um, even if that weren't to be the case, I mean, shit, LeBron does probably have more impressive longevity than Kareem, and that would be the main thing that I would argue him over Jordan. And if I have that argument for someone else, and I would say that Michael Jordan has a better peak than Kareem, and he doesn't have the longevity either, I think transitive property, that's what it is, but I would cut him out for that. Hmm. I wonder why the old heads have Kareem in there. I think yeah, his dominance. Do. Do yeah, his dominance. I mean, I'm looking at dominance for real, for real, for real. When I hear the odds talk about Kareem, they always bring up that scoring record, though. I mean, it's most points in NBA history. But now you don't even got that, so I don't know. Yeah, but I think if you hear old heads talk about, like, Kobe and AI, they're also supposed to be in that conversation, too. So I don't know. You probably yeah. listen to the wrong old heads, sure. that barbershop talk. Um, I do see C-Rod joined up. Yeah, C-Rod and Ty Dolla Sign. I don't know if you Oh, shit. Know. That nigga's outside. Hi. Hey. Can you hear me? Yeah, we can. Uh, 
Um, so I'm with Domo. I don't like Michael Jordan like that. I'm a I'm a LeBron James guy. Like he's he's been dominant forever. Like I've seen this thing. He had three MVP seasons. I mean three like MVP like Hall of Fame careers. Like when his first stint with Cavs, he was MVP. He went to the Heat, MVP championships, went back to uh Cleveland championship, went to the Lakers championship. Like the only thing you got with Michael Jordan is that he did with one team. That's kind of a lame argument for real. But did you come here to argue that LeBron? Yeah, I'm gonna say, are you arguing for LeBron? <laughs> I mean, yeah, LeBron's my girl. Oh, we don't care. We about already that. know. Yeah, we already know. Yeah, we yeah we were asking for um non non LeBron Jordan or Kareem. If you like, basically, because there's gonna be pushback. Granted, most of the chat doesn't, but there's gonna be pushback on the idea that any player outside of LeBron, Kareem, and Jordan are in the goat debate. And to a degree, I'll even allow people that have Kareem to argue because, as you see, I just kicked them out. I don't really but, put oh. I'm oh, like, go ahead. I only Kareem because he had he was coattailed by Magic Johnson. So damn, why would you really put him right there? Like, come on, for real, for real, for real. When he, I, when I hear you. Magic Johnson first got there, he won. In, he won Finals MVP. Granted that he did break his foot, Kareem, but like the man had a monster game to win him the championship. So that they one game, Magic stole that, by the way. Yeah, I was about to say what. So that one game means that he stole that. Are you going yeah. on the TV? A, a lot of a lot of people had it. No, like a lot of people have, have said the argument that like you tell Ma- Magic me. Magic had the craziest, you know, closing game, but okay, for the whole series like Kareem that, was better. Oh, even after that championship, you still think that Kareem was really like the number one option? Yeah. I mean for a couple of years. And then at some point, yeah, Magic became the clear one, but not it wasn't like oh Magic's rookie year boom and then the rest was just the Magic show. I'm looking at what, what's this? They won the ring in eighty one eighty two when yeah. Kareem averaged mm-hmm. twenty four on fifty eight percent from the field. Uh, what was, was it? 80, unless I'm tripping. Three blocks. No, I mean I'm just looking at the, the years they won the ring. But no, 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 yeah. And then Magic was, yeah. No, I mean, hey, if that's the lore that you want to go with, fine. But Magic, he wasn't backpacked by. Magic for probably until like the isn't the back half the of mid, the mid eighties. Okay, we can't yeah. say backpack, but we can say he at least had a good team built around him because he also had James Worthy. Well, so did MJ. Yeah, and now 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 your argument is stronger if you were to argue that him. he's really only a three time champion to you. That'd be slanderous. But you could if that was your argument, I could hear it because um, the latter three. I mean, Kareem was a shell of himself. I think we all agree. But um, nah. Nah, he, he got at least three of them. He he at least I probably give him four. We at least got three of them for sure. How many finals does this nigga have two? I don't know. Kareem has yes, two. Two? I can see that. Yeah, they, hate, they hate. They hate that, 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 but, that, but that's but that's why I said he could have did a little more. Hey, I'm just saying that's I, why he could have did more. I, I, but but I he was holding this. Milwaukee. He was holding Milwaukee. And I will say this: I mean, going from Lou to Kareem, you know, during that time. Hey man, you gonna get hold? So I don't know. Pick your battles: religion or <laughs> or accolades. I don't yeah, know. That's what I he literally got hold. I <laughs> will not. Crazy. I will admit he literally was. That's what it is. That's what it is. I probably would have okay. picked the uh, accolades over the religion, but anyway, appreciate you. Oh my appreciate god. You. Okay, before I go, can I say something? Sure. Go ahead. Omar, I've been wanting to say this to you for a minute. Oh, oh shit. I feel like you should stay. Like I remember that time that people were like, "Omar shouldn't be here and stuff." You're literally like one of my favorite people on this thing. No glaze for real. Oh, like I, I like how you be like, um, you do those stupid takes, but you know it's stupid. And you just want the reaction of people. <laughs> like you be like, forget black woman. <laughs> well, but like they obviously know that you're, they obviously know you're being like crazy about it. This is your brand. <laughs> That's. <laughs> That's so terrible. Describe Omar in one sentence. Forget black woman. <laughs> That's what you say. That's what you say. Yeah. You're saying the most famous thing. Yo, I just like, love every time when you like you really want to get people mad. Yo, fuck black women every time. I love it. <laughs> but he said, bottom line is he says outlandish things, but you can understand it's just a part of the joke. So like, okay, I'm moving for you, man. You my guy for real. You really Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you. You watch the streams? You watch the streams? 
I watch it all the time. Also, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. he's in Oblock. Like, he lives in Oblock. <laughs> like, <laughs> oh, stop, one thing. Stop, bro. With the YouTube thing, right? Mm-hmm. I got able to upload it just a little bit earlier. Because I oh, go to he wants Oblock earlier, nigga. He wants, <laughs> no, because like, he wants like, all music with, early. With nigga, the, with the podcast, y'all, be, y'all be uploading like 11 o'clock. And like, that feel like it just takes a long time for it to be oh, uploaded. Hey, yep. To be to be honest, the answer is no. The answer is no. Just, I'm gonna let you know that right now. Yeah. And honestly, honestly, we're already it's pushing the it. Earliest now. we can go. Yeah. Earliest is eleven. So. We're probably pushing it now. But appreciate you, appreciate you, see, I appreciate you. Appreciate you. you know we live. You know we live. Come on, now. why would he do that? Right. Appreciate you, man. Why would he set us up like that? Um, let's see what Ty Dallas Sign has to say. Come on now, Dallas Contra- Sign contractually. Like, come on now. <laughs> Yo, Yo, you Yer. Dang, oh, yeah. Are you just breathing at me? <laughs> That's why I fight. It's terrible. <laughs> Try that again. Try that again. You're just pissed Sage. off. <laughs> refresh, refresh the Wi Fi. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking at There's only one finals where Kareem played in it, or I'll say bad, and he was 40. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I would never say that he was shit, but he was uh some of the some of them rings you could say he weren't the best player on. If I had to be a Kareem hater. Or finals, just finals they won, I should say. Finals they won. He was 40. The next year, he, he won 12 and a half. But also, I guess Magic only played three games this finals. They got swept. Niggas not going to talk about Magic stinking it up this finals, too. Hey, hey, hey. Three I, games he played. I don't have Magic in that discussion either, brother. Lame ass Magic. Okay. Um. Anyway, let's uh, let's keep pushing. Are we going to play back tonight after this? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I think so. Fucking love it. And hey, yeah, Reese, getting that nigga ass. Pause. Hello?